few minutes after 8 p.m. on Saturday, May 12th, this Aldi grocery store in Brooklyn Park had just closed its doors, and a shopper was returning her cart when police say she was attacked by a stranger. It's a pretty brazen act in our opinion. Brazen because it was still so light out that Deputy Chief Mark Bruley. So right here is the victim. Can show us the attack unfolding from an indoor surveillance camera. And then here comes our suspect. And right there you can see in his right hand, he uh, has the knife. A knife the victim says she didn't see until it was too late. He's going to then run and uh, corner her in the corner between the carts. And then what you'll see is him push her back brandish the knife, threaten her, and then escort her out, and ultimately demanded she get into her vehicle. Police say the suspect forced the victim to drive at knife point about a mile and a half into Brooklyn Center before eventually stopping right here at this dead-end street. It's here where the victim says the suspect attempted to rape her. She tells police she fought him off not just once. She was um, uh, chased down by the suspect a second time and tackled, and ultimately uh, a second attempt at rape occurred um, in the street. I can't believe it. Mary Bird didn't yeah. witness the commotion, but one of her neighbors did and called police. I'm glad she got away. Police say the victim avoided injury while the suspect avoided arrest. The gate was open and it's always closed. Mary believes he may have fled through her yard, which is why police say this video is now their best hope. We do have a janitor that's actually cleaning up. Unfortunately, they didn't see any part of this assault take place, and now we're reaching out to the public uh, asking for help. Now, police say the suspect is a black teenager who is just five feet four inches tall and was wearing a blue bandana over his face in that parking lot. Now, the victim did get a better look at his face during the attack, and they hope to have a sketch in the coming days. Wow. Right, frightening. Thank you, Kent.